Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. So if any person has committed offense or crime, he obviously gets arrested. However, the arrested person is innocent unless he has proven guilty. But that arrested person is also has some rights. Even uh, the article of 21 of Indian constitution says about this. So without further ado, let's straightly come to the point and let's try to understand what are the rights of arrested person. According to section 50 subsection 1 of CRPC, if police arrest any person, then it is the duty of police to inform the grounds on which the arrest has been done. And likewise, the person also has a right to get informed about the grounds on which he has got arrested. Sometimes it may happen that a police officer may ask his subordinate to arrest a person without a warrant. In that case, subordinate should inform the arrested person the reasons or the grounds on which he is getting arrested through written order. Section 55 of, of CRPC is saying elaboratively about this case. After the arrest, the police officer may interrogate the arrested person. It depends upon the arrested person to keep silence or to answer. To keep silence is another right of arrested person. However, it can't be said that if he is keeping silence, he is guilty. Article 20, Clause 3 of Bharatiya Constitution gives right against self-incrimination. That is, arrested person cannot be compelled to be witnessed against himself. According to Section 76 of CRPC, if warrant has been executed, then the person who is arrested has to be taken uh, to the magistrate within 24 hours. These 24 hours excludes travelling time. Even Article 22, Clause 2 of Bharatiya Constitution emphasize this. An arrested person also has a right to be released on bail. Uh, section 50, subsection 2 of CRPC, when a police officer arrests any person, then police officer should inform that arrested person that he has got a right to release on bail. So after going to the court, the proceeding will start and uh, an advocate will come into the frame. The Bharatiya constitution and CRPC gives right to an arrested person to choose his legal practitioner. Now he has selected his legal practitioner but he is an indigent person. Then he has a right to free legal aid service under article 39A of Bharatiya constitution. Article 21 of Bharatiya constitution gives right to fair and speedy trial. This is because an accused trial should not be in secrecy. Though there are some trials which should be taken in secrecy like rape, when a person has committed a crime and punishment is of two years, then the police has to complete uh, its investigation in six months and this is nothing but called as speedy trial. Suppose an arrested person has requested for the medical examination, then he has a right to be get medically examined under section 54. Uh, subsection 1 of say RPC. The court may direct such medical examination through registered medical practitioner unless the magistrate considered that such examination asked for just to delay the justice. So guys that's it for today. I hope you have understood the rights of arrested person. If you have any doubts or queries you can use the comment box. Meanwhile, you can follow us on Instagram. The link is given in the description box. Until then, bye-bye.